I wasn't super passionate about academics uh, in high school, but upon entering college, um, I just found it to be a lot more interesting, and I was exposed to economics for the first time in Eco 101, and um, I was just personally so excited about economics that I decided it'd be a great idea to pursue that, that excitement and interest and add economics as a second major. It, it always sounds intimidating to people when they first hear about it, but it's really just the study of why people make the decisions that they do. And I think that it's just, it's a jack of all trades major. If you're not good at math, or if you think you're not good at math, it's not gonna get in your way of learning econ. It's, it's definitely gonna be a challenge, but it's not gonna stop you from succeeding. With economics being a smaller major, it's really easy to get support from professors, learning how to communicate and how to email effectively by also attending office hours and realizing that professors are here to help. Everyone that I've had is has more than enough office hours for you to go actually talk to them in person. Sometimes professors are intimidating, but here it's never like that. We are so friendly with the professors and we can like approach and ask anything we want. <laughs> living in Bloomington Normal has been a lot nicer than living in my, my hometown. Hometown doesn't really have that many options for a lot of things. In two days, you could have one day of small town feel and another day of a city feel because in Bloomington, there's like a lot of stores and restaurants to choose from. But in normal, there's still a small community feel, like Uptown Normal, the small businesses and all the small business owners are always so friendly. Even though I'm, a, I'm an international student, it just never feels like um, alienated. Everyone is so welcoming and it's so friendly. People here are very nice. So it feels home now. It feels very communal without feeling like a fishbowl. <laughs> I personally believe that economics um, provides you a lot of opportunities and you know um, I think it's just a good idea to open the door broaden your experiences um, and I think that just increases um, the likelihood of you finding a good job or just different opportunities out there. I know people from the economics who have done stuff like that who have been able to come with a solution they they get a Nobel prizes for that too. You can leave economics with a degree and go be a data analyst. You could be in marketing. You could be an entrepreneur. You could do all of these things and have so much information from your degree based in economics. I really like the way that the economics department is growing and I hope that I can be invited back to come and help future Redbirds with their career as well. I would say that economics is everywhere. It's gas prices, it's grocery shopping, it's all around you. So the economics major is awesome because it also gives you life skills, not just skills that you can use in your career, which is great that you can use all of these skills in careers, but also just in your daily life. Some majors, you don't necessarily get that.